My name is Kyle Casera, and uh, I'm a graphic designer based in Northwest Indiana. My business, Kyle Casera Design, it focuses on graphic design and developing brand identities. Today, we're going to be talking about the Wasera skateboard project, and we are specifically going to be discussing the approach towards developing illustrations. So. Wasera Skateboards started during our ambitious high school and college years. It was a passion for the arts project and uh, we saw a void in the local skateboard community where we figured that we could fill and in turn we were inspired directly by the Chicagoland area and we developed a series of skateboards that could relate directly to the individuals that we were skateboarding with each and every day. And once the boards came out and were produced, they were a huge hit. And you would see kids and adults the same skating them all around the Lake County, Chicagoland area. For the three skateboards within the Wasera Skate Anywhere series, my inspiration was drawn directly from the visuals that you see. For the city skateboard, I was inspired by the tall buildings, the lights, the hustle and bustle of downtown Chicago. For the more gritty urban environment skateboard, I was inspired by some of our very old historic cities that sit more on the north side of Lake County, Gary, Hammond, East Chicago, and I really wanted to captivate the roughness of some of these more urban environments. And for the country scene, I was inspired directly by all of the green grass, all of the windmills, all of the very country-esque elements that make up an environment that you may see around Lowell, Crown Point, St. John. And once those all came together, it really paints a picture for a series that represents Chicagoland as a whole. After initially being inspired is to develop concept sketches. The concept sketches, it's a more of an organic approach towards drawing. The whole part of the concept sketching process is to just brainstorm. And it helps me get my ideas out in a more free flow manner. After that, I in turn take my sketches and I scan them into the computer. Once the sketches are in the computer, you have to redraw them digitally. Once that process is done of inking your drawing, you now have a digital file that is ready for production. So as for the colors that I use for the Skate Anywhere series, it was inspired by a very basic color palette. We use the green for the country, we use the red for the more concrete urban environment and then we use the blue for all the shiny buildings and the reflections that they give off in the city. Connecting with my own artwork is definitely a critical aspect of my overall design process. You know, I, I need to ensure that I'm looking at my artwork through the eyes of the individuals that I'm targeting and in turn I'm able to perceive it how they are going to perceive it because ultimately my perception of my artwork, it matters, but in the end, all of design is about communication and when the individuals that you are marketing towards connect and engage effectively with the brand you're presenting to them, then you are gonna see success with your company as a whole. I really love that graphic design is all around us in our everyday lives. You might be driving down the highway, flipping through a magazine, on your cell phone, on the computer. We're all constantly being marketed towards. And graphic design is something that is going to be expanding even further in the future with all the applications of digital work, print work. It's something that moves businesses and moves individuals and 
that's what I love most about it, is that it's, it's designed for a purpose.